is how the unit's going to come to you if you uh, purchase one of our batteries. Now you can buy these from Haas. I don't know the part numbers, but it's a it's a module here. Let me open it with one hand. All right, pretty straightforward. All right, so there's a battery. This is uh, a replaceable. Um, lithium battery. Let me pop the clip on this so you can see. The retainer okay there we go. I apologize. I've never tried to do this one-handed. Alright so here's the base. Here's the battery. Okay. This is the size. BR two slash three A, right? Standard lithium and the retainer. <clears throat> so, of course, uh, <clears throat> there is a. I don't know if you could see it, but there's a direction on here, and a battery goes in a certain way, right? So positive to the left. Then the clip, just a good idea, and the plug. Okay, so. I'm going to wrestle with this rat nest here off screen, and we're going to go and we'll put this in the machine itself. Um, by the way, this comes with the Velcro. <clears throat> it's all soldered together. So <clears throat> if you ever get another little battery warning, when this in, after this is installed in the machine, you just pop this clip off of here, slide your new battery in. If you do this while the machine is powered up, uh, you will not lose memory. Right, so once this is installed and you're running, uh, changing batteries out is a five-minute process, and you can do it. You know, uh, if you do it safely, uh, you can you can get out for the cost of a battery. Um, now, be careful if you're back there and the machine is on and powered up. You've got a lot of juice. This machine's running on three-phase, 220 um, or 208, whatever they call it nowadays, and um, uh, so it can be dangerous, uh, but we're going to mount this in a place where we can get at it very easily, even when the unit's powered up and we don't have any, any issues.